Ten-year Treasury note futures open this session lower. It seems like it all started in China as the yuan rebounds off 17-month lows as the government has vowed to boost their economy. That was enough to get yields across Asia Pacific higher on the day. It seemed to filter over to uh, Europe, whereas um, we saw boons undercut on the early going, initial weakness as Eurozone consumer prices hit a record pace this morning. On top of that, German March import prices hit the fastest pace in 47 and a half years. Get into our section, at least the bulk of our section, the price action was fairly stable. Questions over whether the Fed will accelerate the pace of uh, rate hikes given quarter one employment cost index hit a record of 1.4. They're expecting much less than that and the highest since 1996. Also, March core prices uh, up less than expected. On the other hand, we saw Chicago April PMI uh, significantly lower and University of Michigan report revised lower as well. That said, we saw weak dollar stocks on both sides, the plus and minus side, wind range, and also people continue to monitor uh, Russian news flow. Getting into options, I look at CME Group CVOL, looking at June, trading in the 80th percentile on both a one and three month basis. At the money vols are higher today. Skew though is lower as the down variance or put wing is up more than the call variance or up variance. Options volume is pretty strong. Uh, 119 strike and 119 half strike seem to be the uh, apex of it all. And lastly, looking at uh, CME Group E Micro Mini Futures, yield based futures, volume very strong today. Yesterday we saw a volume of 4,597 with an open interest of 2,512.